There's nothing more satisfying in football than seeing a youth player come through the ranks and absolutely kill it for his boy or club in the first team. But there's nothing worse than seeing these players fail when they reach that final hurdle due to many reasons. Enter Hatem Ben Arthur. Ben Arthur came through the Clairefontaine Academy, which if you don't know, players such as Mbappe, Henri, Anelka, Giroud and many more came through. When Ben Arthur finished his development at Clairefontaine, at just 16, French coaches and media were already touting him as the French Lionel Messi. This would ultimately get him a spot at Lyon's Academy, where he'd been offered a professional deal at just 18, snubbing the likes of Chelsea and Ajax. After a few months of hit and miss performances, he would really begin to show himself as a truly talented young footballer, even going on to win League One Young Player of the Year. He went on to win four consecutive league titles, playing alongside the likes of Janino, Benzema and Essien, but after multiple bust-ups with teammates, coaches and staff, he'd be forced to be moved on by Leon. One of Ben Arthur's former teammates, Mike Williamson, even said, talent-wise, I don't think it's an exaggeration to mention him in the same esteem as Cristiano Ronaldo or Lionel Messi. Ben Arthur would take a sideways move to Marseille, but following a bust-up with then Marseille manager Didier Deschamps, he was forced to move on to another club. This behaviour would force him to move to Newcastle, and despite his absolutely amazing solo goals versus the likes of Bolton, Blackburn, Chelsea, and the list goes on, when things weren't going Ben Arthur's way, he was heavily criticised. Criticised day in, day out for his lack of work weight, overall personality, it would ultimately end his spell at Newcastle. Former Newcastle coach Steve Bruce would even describe him as a total nightmare. So despite moments of individual brilliance in the Premier League, he was looked to find a new direction. He ended up flying back to France with Nice. He set League One on fire, earning himself to move to Paris Saint-Germain to play alongside the likes of Thiago Silva, Ibrahimovic, Edison Cavani, Angle Di Maria and David Luiz. But he failed to make an appearance for the club for a whole season. And once again, Ben Arthur would have a poor relationship with his manager Unai Emery and even tried to sue the club himself. Inevitably, Ben Arthur left PSG and joined the likes of Wren and then found his way to League One champions Lille but struggled to find the form that he once shown in the Premier League. But what do you put this down to? Laziness, bad attitude, never finding the right manager? Let us know down below. We'll see you next time on Sporf.